Hi, this is Eli Kim with Guns and Tactics. Today we have an unboxing video from Apex Tactical Specialties. Um, earlier this week, I got a package from them um, that had a t-shirt, pretty cool t-shirt. It says, um, Behind Enemy Lines, uh, Los Osos, California. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Um, and they also sent me this tool, which I have no idea what it does. So if you guys can tell me what it is. Um, that'd be awesome. Um, but today, I got a paint can from them. I didn't really, uh, that's as far as I got. Um, I realized uh, I should probably get this under uh, on camera. Uh, on the front it says Apex Tactical Specialties, and then it says that it's an Action Enhancement Trigger Glock. Um, if you guys have been paying attention to Instagram, they have released some pictures of this uh, new trigger. I'm assuming there's one in here, but it's kind of heavy, so I'm wondering if Apex is playing a trick on me or a prank or I'm, I'm wondering if this is like one of those things where you open it up and snakes fly out of it but um but yeah uh it uh it has some some cool stickers on it it says new Glock replacement trigger now with 100% more Apex and so and there's a picture of the trigger on there so I hope there's a trigger in here um on the side there is a warning that says caution do not give to friends they'll keep it can cause extensive range use if overused may cause financial damage through excessive ammunition purchases keep out of reach of your friends uh, has their social networking websites and their contact for information um, on the back it says it is a trigger and a drop-in trigger actually um, it reduces overall trigger travel while providing smooth uptake and reset along with a crisp trigger break. So that sounds good. Uh, it looks like that the application for this trigger is supposed to be for a third gen uh, standard frame. Uh, it's not supposed to be used gen 4s, uh, but I'm sure they'll come out with one. Uh, installation basically tells you to field strip, remove the pins, remove the locking box, slide lock lever, trigger assembly. Uh, basic all the general stuff. If you know how to take part of your Glock, this is um, what you'll have to do to get your trigger bar out. Um, and the last, there's a warning that says this produce this product contains aluminum, steel, and anodized coating. All products known to irritate California state officials who don't like firearms. So in other words, install said parts in an unavailable Glock pistol and enjoy. And since the guys are in <clears throat> California, um, I'm guessing that's why they went with this whole red theme on top of it because... Um, it says right here, manufactured behind enemy lines in Los Osos, California. So I guess this is a throw out to uh, the Republic of uh, California. California. All right, let's see what's inside. So what's in there? It's a replacement trigger. But they put it in a paint can. So when it officially comes out, it will be like this. Oh my god, what the fuck is this shit? What, is what that? the f What does that do? Just you know I'm recording it. Oh wait. This is an armorer's block. What? Armorer's block. So it's a way to work on stuff for your gun. <laughs> this, nice. This is this is what I always thought was a really cool idea. That's oh, really cool. enhanced trigger. Okay, now you can get back my thermal spoons. Wow, an enhanced trigger bar set. A Glock Ultimate Safety Plunger. It means a super smooth trigger function. And yeah. the assembly block. So you, you can put together the trigger like that. That's pretty cool. Yeah. Everything's in red. To give you guys a better understanding of what came in this package, uh, Apex actually sent me two packages and um, they were separated and I didn't quite understand what was in it at the time, um, but when I finally put the two together, 
it uh, started to make some sense. Initially, Apex sent me this t-shirt with this odd looking tool. And um, for a while, I couldn't figure out what the heck it was for. Um, and then about a week later, Apex sent me the rest of the, the rest of this gear. And the paint can came with the, uh, you know, obviously with the lid attached. And uh, I used the uh, a thermos spoon to open it up, um, like you know, just a foldable spoon, camp camp spoon. And now I'm sitting here holding this thing. I realized that this would have been the perfect tool to open up the paint can with. Um, so uh, unfortunately, I did not figure that out um, in time. Uh, but now I, I'm, I, you know, I got to give props to Apex. Uh, this was a pretty uh, snazzy release of this product. Um, so what was included was uh, they sent me an Apex T-shirt, and on the back of it, it covers everything that Apex has done to this point and their future goals as to what kind of trigger enhancements and types of. Uh, gear they want to yeah. expand on. So as you can see, they got the Smith & Wesson revolvers, the M&P, the Sigma, the 320 for the SIG, Glock, and the next five that they are aiming at are the uh, SR9 from Ruger, PPQ from Walther, FNS uh, from FN, CZ pistols. I'm guessing what they're um, going to be going after is probably um, the uh, P07, maybe uh, the 75 series, and the Sig Sauer P200 series. So all the classic pistols that um, you guys uh, um, use. Uh, the armor's block here is an uh, interesting setup. They they have the the pin, uh, the punch tool, sorry, and a uh, Allen wrench here. Um, just generic tools to work on your Glock with. Um, and then they have this armor's block that can be adjusted. I'm not quite sure how this is used. I uh, have seen videos on YouTube that people have given tutorials as to how they're using them. Um, Apex just basically says to call their 18, uh, their, uh, their 1805 number in uh, Los Osos. Uh, let's see if I can zoom in on that or at least get you guys a picture of it. Huh. Okay. Alright, there you go. Um, so what else is included is the, the uh, Glock Action Enhancement Trigger with Factory Trigger Bar. So that's a direct drop-in. Uh, you get your Glock Trigger Assembly Block that you can put the Enhancement Trigger onto, uh, onto your existing Trigger Bar. And they also include a Safety Plunger. Um, I'm assuming that this is a uh, slightly modified, uh, or design, sorry. Um, safety plunger that will increase uh, the smoothness of your trigger action. Uh, yeah guys, this is what uh, Apex sent me and it was a, a really cool thing to see. Thanks for watching the video, hopefully you enjoyed it. Subscribe so you can watch more unboxing events and product reviews from GunsAndTactics.com.